Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Operation True Love, episode 46 to 47. Due to Webtoon's new policy, I do have to blur 50% of each episode. So if you guys do want to read along with me, it's available on webtoons.com. For anyone out there who wants to support me, I do have all these reads with no cat logos, no censorship, and all that blurs. So if that's something that is up your alley, definitely check it out on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. Let's go ahead and get started. Bro, Yu Yu looks really good. I opened this page and I saw his face. It's like, man. And a little bit of me want to like start reading Midnight Poppy Land. So I might upload that whenever I do have time because I do have to read out for September and October all at once. But he he makes me think of uh, Tora from Midnight Poppy Land. <laughs> and I can't go because <laughs> he's like technically he's in high school here and that's kind of gross for me to say that because I'm a lot older you know Operation True Love episode 46 I have to get going now it's almost time for my appointment my friend is coming soon <laughs> already who's your friend we're gonna oh oh it's me so I'm Sue's friend. Yin-Yuk, you're here early. There's still five minutes left. Oh. oh, I thought we could hang out, but that's probably not a good idea now. It's kind of awkward being around him. Who said I wanted to hang out with you? Oh, what? You started it. Um, what's wrong with you two? Why does it feel so weird? Oh, hmm. Hey, what's the matter? <laughs> uh. Uh. He is jealous. No. <laughs> Been seeing you a lot lately. Huh? <laughs> right. Too much. <laughs> Seriously, what's wrong with you guys? <laughs> We should hurry up and get the gifts. We're gonna be late. Hey, what's wrong? And you should get home before it's too late, Doa. Bye! Gifts. Huh. See ya! <laughs> okay. The gifts. The previous day. Da -da -da -da. Uh, Secret Santa? What are we in elementary school? Pick your secret Santa. I know, right? Good luck to mine. They uh, they can look forward to their gift. <laughs> I don't have money to buy a gift. I have to pay back my PC room advance. Advance. My PC room advance. Sweet. I was pretty excited when our teachers said we would do a secret Santa at the beginning of the semester. Me too. I was so envious of the other class last year. Please, just don't let it be Chilman Quack. Wake? Who's mine gonna be? I hope someone I'm close to. Huh? Yu Seon Jang? Ugh, I'm not close to him at all. Ugh, what am I supposed to give him? Gwang Minji would have been better. The, uh, Minji Kim is written all over his face. What am I supposed to give her? Ugh. Hey, Yin Yuk. Wanna switch? I've already checked who got who. No exchanges. Uh, with me? Uh. Wanna help each other pick out the gifts? Which brings us to now. We decided to help each other with our secret Santas. Minji was easy. Make it would do it. Blush, fruity red, cloudy lake pink. And there were so many makeup stores all around, and I knew she was out of her tinted lipstick. And for you soon... <sighs> are, are we there yet? How much longer? We're here. There. Huh? Record. Record. Music... Music and coffee. He got some fancy taste, I see. Uh, lucky me, I get to come here because of my secret Santa. 
We came to a record shop out in the middle of nowhere to find the album of a foreign indie band Yusun likes. I totally picked wrong. I should have just got him a simple pencil case or something. Five minutes, one second of last wonder. That's a long name for a band. Listen to it over there before you pick it. Cut. Wow, not bad. What are you listening to? Huh? Uh, he already has this one. He listens to it the most. Ugh, why does he have to creep up like that? He used to act so awkward around me, but now he pretends like those days never happened. Hey, you, you, huh? Help me pick then. Hmm. What do you think about this one? Uh, huh? What do you think? I think it's fine. He's like softer music. Huh? Softer music? Now playing a heavy metal album. Uh, oh! If that was a joke, it wasn't funny. Uh, or is this kind of metal softer to him? Anyways, you're saying no to this one right too, right? Let's listen to, listen to the next one then. Huh? Uh. Hi. He's turning around. That's his house. His place is not very organized. <laughs> Look, I still wish that, you know, if I go on a date, that a guy would take a picture with me in the photo booth and, like, have that cute kind of memories. I take pictures all the time like that with my friends, but, like, never with a guy, you know, that I care about. <laughs> Or have a huge crush on our love. And she has both. <sighs> Operation True Love, episode 47. The teacher's really outdone himself. What? The Secret Santa, I mean? <laughs> Everyone's pretty excited about it. The class is all hyped up. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess so. You're kidding, right? Hyped up? I'm pretty annoyed. It's just my luck to get stuck with Chiu Min Qu Quake. So, did you buy him a gift? Read the room, yes sir. No, I know I'm not getting him something because I want to, but I just can't do it. Yeah, I get that. <laughs> Maybe I'll just disappear for a bit and take the punishment. Everyone, the results are in. See what group you've been placed in based on your math scores. Man, it's already, it's out already? What if I'm in the bottom half? It starts today, so everyone go to your respective classes during math. 10th grade, first semester, math scores. So, aren't you gonna check, Sue? Oh, nah, I know I'm in the bottom class anyways. I guess everything on the test, so there's no way I'm in the top. I'm Sue, who needs math when I'm going to art school. Who needs math when I'm going to art school? And art schools don't really look at your math scores. I acted pretty cool about it, but I was a little embarrassed that I was the only one in the bottom class. Top class, bottom class. Ugh. But Agent's in the top group too. Doesn't she go to art class with you? <laughs> Oh, Jack. I'm just good at everything. <laughs> Man. Yeah, good for you. Z testing, testing. The following students must report to the teacher's office. 10th grade class 7th, Seon Jio Kim. 10th grade class 2, Erem Lee. 10th grade class 2, 
Seon Ho Jion, 10th grade class 3, Sue Shim. Huh? 10th grade class 5, Giyu Giyumin Kim, 10th grade class 8, Yun, Yun Ho Lee, 10th grade class 10, Doa Bake. The stragglers. Even the word sounds disgraceful. That's why you guys need to start with the basics and rebuild your foundation. Us seven even us seven didn't even make it to the bottom class. We've been placed somewhere even lower. You just start again from additions and subtractions. Sir, but I'm in the sciences. Ugh. That's not what you guys need to be worrying about right now. The role doesn't categorize. You like that, all right? Do you understand what I'm saying? How embarrassing. I know they say math is just a matter of being a good guesser, but this is just too shameful. Ugh. Uh? <laughs> is that a straggler group? <laughs> Covering her face with her hair. Whoosh. What's wrong? You embarrassed? Uh -uh. Aren't you? <laughs> I'm an idle trainee. I don't have time to study. Huh? Oh, no, you're not. What the, the? I thought you said you weren't. Oh, not officially, but. <laughs> I knew it. That's why he hasn't denied the rumors. Oh, hey, Yun Yuk. Yun Yuk. Wait a second. Okay. Uh. Huh? Uh. The Next up, Doa. Not him again. Hey. S Round forehead? Neat eyebrows? Chiseled nose? Her bangs are gone. She looks even prettier now. Wow, she's so pretty. Hey, Ryan. T oh, what's up? Did you cut your hair? It's pretty. You should have uh, done that sooner. She didn't cut it. She just restyled it. Ignore. Janu Jion did this. Oh. He threw his pencil case and it hit me and he's always at that in the classroom. You should have just covered it with your hair. Why do you change it? I wanted the people to worry about me. <laughs> hmm. Huh. Did my love points drop again? Uh, what do you... What do you think? My hairs. Uh. Huh? Oh. T -t your shirt. Uh. It feels like I've won somehow. Okay, let's not get all excited about it. Uh. Huh? Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I kept you waiting. Congrats to our first, second, and third top students. You'll be receiving your academic scholarship soon to be sure to tell your parents. And you have an extra hour of class every Thursday after school, don't forget. You don't want to be take, take extra classes forever, do you? Huh? Answer me so I know you understand. Yes! Don't get all whiny about not having gotten advance notice. If you understand, you can go. Ugh. Quiet, you punks. Ding dong, ding dong. Straggler class. <sighs> All right, now that I've explained everything, you can do it on your own right now. Uh, own now, right? Huh? You don't get to go home until you solved it. Take your time. All right? I'm so screwed. I wasn't paying attention at all. Dun dun. Ugh. See you tomorrow. Tick, tuck, tick, tuck. Am I going to have to stay here all night because of you two? Head it into the teacher's office when you're done. And I'm confiscating your phone. No cheating allowed. That's your punishment for making me work overtime. What? No, that's not fair. Wow, are you really going to punish your students like this? The only things that unfair is you keeping me here for hours over a simple problem. You have to write essays on any problem you get wrong, so don't even think about being lazy. T 
<laughs> so, want to solve it together? It's about to be 8 p.m. Empty. So, did you hear something just now? Don't know. They're locked in. Oh my goodness. Uh, all done. Let me see. Blank. Blank. Seriously? I have no room to judge, but still. Just hand it in and write the essay. So mean. Then are, are you going to make me write an essay too for allowing you to cheat? That's cold. Uh, huh? What's going on? Oh man, they are locked in there for, for the night, so now they get to know each other, even if they don't want to. <laughs> I don't know, I, I would be scared. And plus, like, they don't have their phone with them to call someone, like, hey, I'm locked in school. They can't really, like, if their parents were to be worried about them, especially for Sue's parents who love and dote on her a lot, they have no way of contacting her. And they're going to think, like, something bad happened because she never goes quiet, you know? So, is it going to be interesting? Me, as an adult, I'll be like, oh my god, what, you know, I'll think about, like, their safety. I was like, bro, you didn't tell your parents and stuff and you're stuck here. My... I would be worried. I would be a worried parent. But anyway, sorry for rambling on. But if you guys enjoyed my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments on how y'all feel about this. And man, how you feel about Doa being so close to Sue. But anyways, if you guys enjoy it, definitely leave a comment and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!